Hello fellow Sudokans, welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Wednesday the 30th of July 2025, I hope you are keeping well. Second attempt at the Los Angeles Times expert level puzzle because I was just doing it a moment ago and feeling smug with myself, feeling, oh look at this, I'm almost at the end, no pencil marks. I've done a good job here, found some nice logic and then suddenly, ah, ah. I messed it up. There was a mistake there somewhere. I don't know where the mistake occurred, but it occurred somewhere. And so I've got to start again. So uh, if you're a beginner to Sudoku, uh, notice that you do sometimes have to start again. It's one of those things. Um, well, I do anyway. Uh, if there's anybody perfect in this world who's never had to start again, well, I... Uh, well, either my hat goes off to you, or I just don't believe you. <laughs> One of those two. Anyway, I've got to start again. Uh, what was I saying before? I was talking about China, and uh, there being an article in The Guardian about flood re flood relief for Beijing residents being maybe not forthcoming, or not, or rather difficult for people to get. And I was um, opining on the state of Chinese uh, government and how much support it gives its citizenry. And we don't know if it's much or not much um, uh, now that they've become really a very capitalist country. And I was also con mentioning about the fact that, that I, I see I did all this the first time and I can't think of it. Uh, I was mentioning the fact that um, the government uh, supports its businesses as well. So that's when 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 the West, which is wholly capitalist and relies on companies, uh, you know, criticizes China. If China is supporting its companies through government subsidies, capitalists hate that, of course. Um, but, um, you know, that actually is a benefit for the people. Uh, I'm not sure that they are doing that, but <laughs> they ought to technically be doing that at the very least. Anyway, I was saying that I don't have too much uh, knowledge of the Chinese uh, social security net, but if anybody in China is watching, uh, then you could let me know but then again people in China don't watch YouTube they don't have YouTube because they're not allowed to because it is an authoritarian state but I was wondering if maybe they have something called WeTube instead because they do have WeChat and We other things you see the tourists using it all the time here in Bangkok so maybe anyway let's get on with the game because I'm impatient to start now because because I just failed. All right, so this is my second attempt. But I did discover some things, and as I said, I did not use pencil marks, and I almost finished. So I s either I made a mistake at the end, or I went somewhere wrong early on. But I'll tell you the first thing that one of the important things that I noticed. Okay, do you see that one blocks this square, this square, and this square in the bottom row? So that enables us to know that this is digit one in these two squares here, right? Now, if we take 7 and 3 blocking across here, that means 7 and 3 are in those squares there. So we have 1, 3, and 7 in those squares there. Now, it didn't uh, give me a... It gave me some stuff. I was further into the game when I discovered that, but I thought I would tell you that right now. This is 1, 3, and 7 in those squares. So we're left here with 6, 8, and 9. I don't know if I can do anything the first time around. I've got to find a few more numbers, first of all. Let's do that first. But I will come back to that in a minute and show you that important piece of uh, logic. Hopefully it was correct, and that wasn't where I went wrong. I can't see that that's where I went wrong. Um, so uh, we'll see if it works out um, soon. Now we've got four blocking across here and down here. Take that across. So four is in one of these two squares blocking across, and the four down here will give us four in that square. Four up, four down, four across there. There's our four. Um, eight blocks down here, up there and across there, so there's an eight we can grab. And then maybe we'll start going around the clock first so remember ones are in those squares okay 
Right, what else do we know? Two blocking up here, two blocking up there. There's our two. Two across there will give us two in that square there. Two blocking down here, two across there. There's two. Now, what I said was... Uh, hopefully it was right. Yeah, it was right. One and two block this square. One and two block this square. So that's a pair of one and two down here. And it means that these are not one or two. They should be. I worked it out six and nine last time. Yeah, that's correct. Six blocks this square. So that's our six. And this is our nine. And of course, nine is the last digit up there. Now, if you remember... I said we had 9 as one of these squares. We've got, remember, 7, 3 and the 1's in those squares. So 1, 3, 7 in those squares. So that means that 9 is somewhere here. So 9 blocking across there. 9 down here and 9 down there. There is our 9. <coughs> I really don't like replaying games. But, um, you know, what can you do? If you mess it up, you got to start again. Um... Okay, three blocks down here and across here. So three is in one of these squares. So that can't be three. That must be three. And the last number down here now is five, I think. Okay, now we know this is one and two. And so this has... Oh, let's get that number there first of all. This is uh, five. Uh, we know that's one and two. So this has to be th three, six. Six blocking across there. There's our six. And this is our three. Three blocking across here and across here. There is our three. So far, so much the same. I don't know if that's good or bad because I definitely messed it up. Uh, now, we had one, three, and seven in those squares, right? So now we've got one and seven here so we can work this out. This has to be a five. Five up here, five down there, five across there. There's a five. Um. Okay, let's see where we can go. Well, I'm stuck now. Um, well, I wasn't stuck before, but as I say, got it wrong. So let's see where I ought to go from here. Let's see. Um, so once again, this is 1 and 7. I know that. And this is 6, 8, 9. So should we come back in this direction? No, that's not going to be anything. We've got 4s there. 1, 2. Don't know about
Okay, four blocking up there puts four into one of these two squares blocking back down. Four across there, four across there means that must be a four. Uh, this may be something, may not be. This is not something I did before. But I've got eight, nine blocking there. I've got eight, nine blocking there. So these squares can only be eight, nine. And yes, that can't be eight. So that's got to be eight. And that's got to be a nine. And what are we left with? One seven, right? Okay, yeah, because we got one seven there. So that makes sense. One seven there. Okay, so something a bit different now. That's good. So eight across here, eight blocking across there. That gives me eight in that square. So the missing numbers here are two, three, nine, I think. Yeah, and we got three and nine together. So that will be our two. Two blocking down here, two down there. There's a two, two across there. There's a two, there's a one. Missing numbers here are seven and seven and seven and what? Seven and eight. Eight blocks down there. There's the eight. There's the seven. Eight blocks up here, up here, and across there. There's the eight. I don't think I, I don't think I I did needed this. Did I need this thing down here that I discovered? Maybe. Not sure it's helped much, but something I spotted early on when playing the other game, playing the first time. Uh, right, two and eight are finished. So let's click on the numbers now, see if we can find a way forward. Uh, as they are, one, not sure, three. Three blocks across here, so three is in one of these squares blocking back, and three up there gives me three in that square the last number to place here is nine nine blocking up up and away and there's a nine so now we got one and nine here or one and nine across there so it means that's a pair of one and nine uh, we can work this out can't we this is uh seven four and seven so four blocking up there there's the four there's the seven we know this is one and nine so that has to be a three three blocking down three up there there's a three right six blocks down here six has to be in one of these two squares here blocking down six across there will give us the six there uh, this was one and seven so this is nine nine blocking up there there's the nine missing number here one one blocking down there's one one across there one down there there's our digit one um, One down there. There's a one. One down there. There's a one. This is a seven. Missing number over here is four, I think. Four blocking up here, up there, and across there. There's a four. The last number in the row is five. Five blocking down and up. There's a five. Uh, missing number here is seven seven blocks across there there's a seven this will be six need a six there six blocking up there's a six and finish with a seven okay it was relatively painless the second time a bit painful the first time <laughs> didn't take too much longer but as i say it came to a sticky ending take care bye bye